Dave once again with EVM TV. And you know, a lot of people are asking us this day, these days, what can they put their faith in? What can they put their hope in when everything around them seems to be crumbling? They're losing their jobs, the economy's in shambles, they turn on the evening news and there's nothing but discouragement, dismay, and a falling economy. Well, I have with me uh, Pastor Brent Hofen of the Mission Church here in Bend. And one of the things that's exciting for us as pastors is more and more people are turning to God, aren't they, Brent? That's very true. We uh, at Mission Church are seeing that people are finding hope because of Jesus Christ. And when other things of the world fail them and they go back to the God who loves them and created them for relationship and put their faith in Jesus Christ, they're finding out that that's where you have life and have it to the full. Now, how many baptisms did you have today? Today we baptized 14 new believers for Jesus Christ. That's amazing. Yes, we've had 40 new commitments to Christ in the last eight weeks, and over the last three years we've seen 150 new commitments to Christ. Is it the economy? What, what's bringing the people to your church in droves? Well, I think people are looking for hope, but I also believe that um, there, people are looking for freedom. And our, we're made to be people who are free, and people can only find that freedom in a relationship with Jesus Christ. And you can look in a lot of places for hope and for freedom, and you can put your faith in finances, you can put your faith in things of the world, you can put your faith in an addiction, and you can be whole, and if you worship alcohol, you're going to become an alcoholic. But if you worship Jesus Christ, you're going to become a person that's free and full of joy and peace. Now, one of the things we were talking about a moment ago where the suicide rate here in Central Oregon is higher than it has been in years past because of the economy. There are people that are going through very, very distressing times, and some people are picking the wrong decision and are taking their lives. So as we're talking to somebody who might be tempted to possibly do that, what would you say to them to convince them to come to Mission Church or another church here in Bend? Mm -hmm. I would definitely um, challenge them that they are made for great things and that they are made to be in a relationship with Christ. And if they want to find out their purpose for living and the reason that they exist, they'll only find it in one source, and that's through Jesus. And they should open their Bible and dig in and start reading because God designed them and made them to be in a relationship with Him. And when they look for that in the Word of God and read about it, He will prove Himself faithful to them. And the place where they hurt the most, I believe with all my heart, God will heal them and give them a real reason to live. And, and they'll desire to want to have a passionate life um, for the rest of their life. Now, another thing we were talking about was a miracle story you have here at Mission Church as far as a new facility. Uh, in these days when there's a lot of businesses closing, a lot of churches are seeing declining membership, you are seeing growing membership, and in fact, God has opened an opportunity for you to have a larger facility. Tell us right. about that. Well, we started out in a furniture showroom on the north end of town, and we were there using their showroom graciously for free for three years and rented and leased the rest of the building for offices and for children's space. And over the last three years, as the economy has declined, um, God has continued to give us open doors and opportunity um, to, to thrive and not just survive in this economy. And as we've sought out the heart of God for our church, he's led us here to what used to be Club 97. We now call it Club Jesus. And uh, there's, a there's a glory ball that used to be a disco ball, but we now call it the glory ball. And uh, we've just moved into a 17,000 square foot facility underneath the Spotted Mule. It used to be Club 97. And every piece of equipment that's down here, we've purchased it um, for the kingdom of God. And the reason that we're able to continue to move forward in this economy is that um, the God that we serve is not on this economy. And, Amen. And he believes in people. And when we put our faith in Him, He's going to bless the, those people for putting their faith in Him. And He's going to make a way for us where the world cannot make a way for us. Amen. What the enemy meant for evil, God used for good. What was a bar is now a place where people are coming to know Jesus. Yeah, we say from beers to Bibles. There you go. Pastor Brent Hofen of Mission Church here in Bend. Uh, people want to get in touch with you. What are they, what are they, where do they go? ExperienceTheHighLife.com because the true high life is in Jesus Christ. God bless. I'm Dave Adams, EVM TV. We'll talk later.